Right, I'm at a new venue. Uh, I'm not going to say too much to start with, but it's a very big lake, 85, 90 odd acres. Um, it really tickled me fancy. Some lovely fish in here. There aren't many, I think, between 15 and 30 fish from what I can make out. Um, and like I say, it's a right old slab. So I'm going to have a go on here. I don't know how much time I'm going to do, but I'm certainly going to have a little go um, since the commonized fishing for us unfortunately passed away. Um, so yeah, the rods are out. Believe it or not, the last couple of days have been sort of 30 odd degrees, but we've just had this awesome weather front come in. It's been chucking it down all day. We've got strong northerlies picked up. And that's the lake, and it's coming from that end up here, and it's a fresh wind, it's getting stronger, and it's tucking more and more into this end of the lake where I'm at. So I'm absolutely buzzing. My mate's just over there, Dave. I think between us, we've uh, got a good shout. But how about that for a proper cool lake? Hopefully, we'll catch one. Oh, right, extremely out of breath. Davey boy's got one. Spooling him, apparently. God, I'm knackered. David, what you got? Oh. <laughs> Sweet. Well, there we go. David's first fishy. It's cool as well. There's the other side. What an awesome little fish that is. Them scales. Well, the main man's back in again. Fun here, isn't you? He is, he's loving it. He's just shy. There you go, common of about mid double, I reckon, which could be a PB for Dave. Here we go. Up we go then, Dave. Yeah. Happy days. Well, I've got a bit of a confession to make. I've uh, got my rods out now as well. I haven't seen anything over the other side all day. Um, and although there is always a chance of a bite out of the blue, there's loads of fish boshing on here and I don't think I'm just gonna catch nothing next door. So last hour, come over here, try me luck. Dave's been catching them, a couple of swims up, but I have seen a couple, a few actually, this side of him. So have a little word in here, see if we can get lucky.
Right, well I'm back down the monster lake uh, that I came to with Dave the other day. It's a very big piece of water, uh, with very few fish in it. Um, but I really like it. So we've come back, we've been watching the weather, um, and we finally got sort of what we've been looking for. So come down this morning, I had my engagement party last night, but uh, managed to get up early and get down here. Um, just about got out of bed. Um, but we're here, the weather's really cool, and we've been watching, we've been laying on the floor and watching all day, all morning, all day, um, we haven't seen anything. Loads of birds in front of us, the wind's smashing down here, it does look really good. Um, the birds are picking us up every now and then, which is a bit of a pain, the water's really clear. Um, but yeah, not seeing anything, I really thought we'd see something today. I've been, you know, been buzzing for the weather when we saw it was arriving. Um, so I'm hoping, you know, we'll stick it out for the rest of the day, I'm hoping at some point we're going to see them bit major anticlimax if we don't but that is the problem with a lake like this you know it's huge and they're very low stock so it's going to be a grawler I'm sure um, but yeah I've got a new ear don't know if you can uh, I'm sure you can see that this big old thing I got stung by a wasp yesterday morning while I was setting up in the dark and uh, it's now swollen so I've got normal ear and I've got this big old thing on the side here it's getting bigger and more hanging off me as time goes on. Um, so hopefully I'll catch one and I can have a nice picture with, uh, with this thing. But uh, yeah, it's looking good, other than we've not seen any fish at all. So I'm gonna uh, cross my fingers, go and sit back on the hill and uh, watch some more. Hopefully we'll see a sign and I think that'll be key. You know, once we see one, I think we'll have a good chance of catching one. But until that happens, you're uh, weeing in the wind, shall we say, without swearing. Well, I was just about to reel in to go home. I haven't caught anything. And look at this. My bobbin has been completely buried by the gravel. Never had that before. I knew it was windy. Right, I'm at a bit of an old haunt of mine, um, Silver End Back Pit. Used to fish this place years ago, um, over 10 years ago. So it's been a while. Uh, I did come back down here a couple of years ago. Uh, I did a night, did a bit of filming for the quarter site. Didn't catch nothing. So hopefully tonight I'll catch one. Uh, I've got my old mate Steve next door, who's uh, under pressure. He's been blanking a hell of a lot lately. So he needs to catch one and make an appearance on the, uh, on the Elliot Starry. But I've put a load of bait out. Um, they used to love their grub on here and from what he's saying people don't seem to do it anymore so I've got one night I thought I'd go for it so I've put yeah put a load of seed and borley out um, and we'll see what happens. There's all sorts of jumping around but I think sort of in this body of water to my left but I think their tension bream mainly. I haven't seen any definite carp that's for sure but um, I've, last few days I've been in Oxford filming for the masterclass. We've been filming Dovey, um, true to form he caught a load. Um, and me and Jack, we pinged our rods out as well um, and didn't catch anything. So I've, I've just done a couple of nights blank um, whilst filming. And hopefully we'll make up for that tonight. Fingers crossed, I've got, me, uh, got a nice dead rabbit in the margin to keep me company for the night. And I've got Steve as well, so it should be good fun. <laughs> Here he is, look, main man. What you done, Steve? What you caught? Uh, only uh, only tri-scale, mate. What's tri-scale? Come on, tell us. The, the viewers don't know what that is, do they? <coughs> Biggest yeah. fish in the lake, that's what that is. Max is here, look. Here he is, ACF Max, say hello. Very early. Very early. <laughs> oh no, wrong way. What a lovely morning. I actually moved at about midnight last night to that area over there. They were going absolutely bonkers, but put two singles out, didn't want to mess Steve up, and uh, haven't caught anything. 
But he's just had the fish a little while ago, just waiting for this light to improve. And then it's his big moment, PB and an awesome carp, 33 and a half pound of slate grey awesomeness. Lovely jubbly. What are you saying, Steve? Happy? I reckon he is. Look at that. Awesome. Oh yeah. Nice job, baby. Wicked heart. <laughs> it's the biggest in the lake. Dun -dun -dun. <laughs> Smile. That's it. Go on in, mate. Say farewell. Let's take him out a bit further. Take him out a bit, mate. Don't get all teary, will you? Right, I've moved. Um, Steve's gone home, and I've basically I've moved into a small bay. So I've got one rod down to me right here in between the trees, um, fishing onto a spot which I've seen them showing this morning and throughout the night. And my other rod is just over here to my left, fishing into the open water, again where they were showing last night, and they've been fishing there this morning as well. So just really done two rods. Might have been a show that. Um, I'm exactly where I want to be now, so I'm feeling confident. Hopefully it's just a matter of time. Kick back and uh, await a bite. Look at these dudes. Oh, hey mate. What's happening? Whoa, was that his bum that just made that noise? Hello mate. And you've got lovely long hair. Little middle parting going on. Curtains. Oh. All right, pal. Just had a massive liner. Well, I think, to be fair, I think I just got savagely done on the rod down here a minute ago. I'm going to uh, possibly reel it in and put a new rig on in a second. But there's definitely a fish there. Um, like I say, the rod let out a big flurry of beeps. There's a huge vortex over the spot, so I'm pretty sure I just got completely mugged off. So a uh, change of rig, I reckon. Get it back out there and uh, hopefully not to get mugged off the next time around. <laughs> 